could get. Let, let's actually That's get into fair. the lore That's for fair. Terminator. Yeah. Uh, tell tell me your thoughts. Uh, what what you didn't like about the lore in Terminator Zero? Because I, I the, the the fact that they so for me I, I I love all the philosophical stuff that they get into. I know. Uh, yeah, you knew you knew that I would. Uh, no, well, yeah, no, I meant Gucci's. He knows I'm gonna roll on, but sorry, no. the philosophical stuff is great. Yeah, uh, if you yeah. like it in this type of franchise. But, but but the biggest lore change when it came to the philosophy is in the original movie. It's all one timeline, and as yes. it was explained in Terminator Zero, where you don't go back to your own past, you go back to another a version past, yes. a past. Which, you hit the crux of what I don't like about it. That and we keep yeah. moving away from John Connor and it didn't matter. There's been a thousand saviors. We just keep hitting the reset button. And it's a new timeline every time. Separate from the other ones. And I, I just don't like it. I is, don't like it, it. A, an, is it an amalgamation of what we've seen before in the past timeline? All the movies counted. They just happened in a past timeline. Right. But what I'm saying is there is, is are there modifications to it, say – I don't know. The, yeah, the, they all the, it looks differently, or is it exactly the same? But it's, they just call it a different timeline. No, uh, everything happened no. exactly the way you remember it. This is just yeah. another run of this, the timeline, basically. Well, that's yeah, happened a thousand times to me. And it's the first time. It, it was sorry. Is it the first time that it wasn't based in America? No. Yes. This is wait. Oh. Wasn't it just showing what happened in Japan? But the, yeah. the right. Skynet right. is still yeah. in. It's it's just it's it's a story in the universe during so you can assume in this timeline even there is a John and Sarah out there or Sarah right. at least, um, but that doesn't matter because the focus is on someone going yeah. back to Japan to stop a very specific person from doing a very specific thing who's also trying to stop Skynet. I yeah. it's very interesting has a lot of great themes. The problem is I've seen those themes done better in Star Trek and uh, the Matrix of, of what is it. But, but that being said, if you like anime and you like Terminator, this is fucking great for you because this is a place to discover all those things. Yeah. It just yeah. throws me off because I, I just, I'm tired of the moving away from John Connor. And it, yeah, it makes me feel like resetting everything every time. I mean, I well, <sighs> so in, in talking about moving away from John Connor, I want to get your take on Terminator Salvation because that's like continuing the storyline of John Connor. How they were originally going to do it is uh, the way that they should have done it. Which was? Do you, do, you, do you, okay. I, if you're, I'll speak it out loud. And <laughs> you tell me if you're really referring to this. So you wanted John Connor to die and you wanted Marcus to wear John Connor like a skin suit and pretend to be him because it was just his face. Mick G, because McG thought that when we saw Terminator John in the future, him just looking like this, he sort of looked like a Terminator. That was his idea to actually. He did make look him robotic, him. actually. Okay, and I, I don't know if they came up with the idea, idea because of that. No, no, no. It Not would make sense idea. as to it's horrible. I, I, I think it's a cool idea because Leon. it would show that there is a longevity that he would have and an endurance by by being this unique robot that is actually the outlier of the entire skynet do you like genesis oh no. god no fuck why that. they no. turn him into a terminator that's what you said would be cool who did they turn into john connor oh, oh john connor into a terminator no 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 no, no. <laughs> i know they you turned... didn't want it done that way you wanted i know i know right. I just it, it's a different war, it's a different way and it's not just because of that happening in genesis that he's now the a t1000 it's not that it's see the problem is everyone it, thinks that they're clever and can prove on a recipe when they don't even know how to cook he, just give me a fucking terminator you don't need to change the rules give me marcus and all this other thing just give me an alien movie you don't need to change the well, rules Badger, the at the end movie. of the day one and two terminator one and two are, that's all you need that's, that's true it. yeah and of course, I mean, like, I mean, that's all we, we can, got right now. We can agree on that. Even, even my, 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 the thing that I'll pitch is if you're going to continue it, you have to do something interesting and that's not a typical way to go about it, which is it clearly didn't work because they didn't make a direct sequel to Terminator I'll meet you Salvation. halfway. I'll meet you actually halfway. I do actually condone Terminator Salvation, the director's cut, where at the end of it, John just gets uh, Marcus's heart and he goes on with a super powerful cyborg heart. Oh, really? Is that what happened in the... What's, what's the theatrical and the directors where there's just extra scenes of John fighting uh, Terminators in the beginning when they raid? But yeah, the actual right. ending of the movie is Marcus dies and gives his heart to John who got stabbed during yeah, the yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, fight. Yeah. So John goes on alive, Christian Bale, John, uh, right. Connor, with the 
it's a cyber card. But either I, way, I would have liked to see the continuation of like, hey, what happens? Like uh, the comic got like, the alternate one, Kyle. The, they did right. a comic where it shows uh, McGee's turning him fully into Marcus turning into. Was Charles. that actually McGee's idea, though? Yes, it was hundred percent. I like to call idea. him Maga. Maga, <laughs> yes, <It's because laughs> that's actually how you pronounce it. <laughs> he got a lot of it right. And uh, the dude that played Kyle Reese that is, uh, is gone uh, now. Um, sorry, uh, check off. Anton Yelchin. Yeah. Thank you, Anton. Yeah. Fantastic fucking documentary. Love great Kyle Reese. Oh, really? Great, great Kyle Reese. Yeah, I mean, he he was a great actor. Yeah. This, he got cut down. Was he was he in the 27 Club? No, no, no. He was checking his mail. Uh, he has his, uh, he didn't put his car in park or something like that. And it oh, rolled yeah, and back he on it. He got trapped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a fucking horrible way to go. Jeep had a yeah. recall. It was uh, their fault. It was Jeep's yeah. fault. Yeah. Wow. Um, yeah. Yeah. That, but... So there you go. I condone the ending of T3 and uh, actually a lot of T3. So many movies are not as bad now in hindsight. The, way, the, way the lore has been so I, thoroughly I, I don't mind because I like it was the it humor off. is a little weird in some of it, but I like, uh, I like Claire Danes as uh, John Connor's wife. Yeah, I like her too. And that's Kate. And that's continued mm -hmm. on. And the fact yeah. that at the same time, they also send a Terminator back to take our John's lieutenants. I like that. That's fine. Yeah. That's wiggle. Yeah. But just Arnold was old, but, and the talk to the hand, and all the shit is. But you, know, you just yeah, don't yeah. like you just don't like the Japanese version where there's something else that could be in store for uh, the timeline. Was John Connor, the, was John, John Connor, Connor the star. Did it end with Judgment Day happening? <laughs> you do yeah. have to continue that in a way. Well, the, well, the problem uh, is most that... of all with John Connor because it's basically saying, "Hey, we're gonna write, we're gonna have the New Testament Bible um, not have Jesus Christ in it." Oh, that's what they're saying. They're moving away that we were wrong. That's my point, by the way, is I've associated him as the Jesus Christ. That's it. He's the one. That's what I associate. They want us to not do that. Terminator is Terminator. John was just one savior, just like Danny would from Dark Fate was a savior. They that's right. that is well, that's what they yeah. want. Yeah, you're you're yes. not advocating that. No, I am not, <laughs> no, not advocating that. Sometimes the, the way you explain things makes it sound like you're <laughs> I want them to understand that I get it, right? I fully yeah. understand what you're trying to do and say, and I do not agree with it. That's James Cameron. That's why he killed John in the first five minutes of Dark Fate. Right. I, I'm not I'm not on that party. Yeah, I'm not uh, on that party either. But yeah. also, how can T3 be canon uh, to Terminator Zero when uh, in T3 they delayed Judgment Day into 2003? Because that was that timeline, and every time you go back, you create a oh, new right. one. It's a multiverse. It's a cop out. It's it's a cop multi out. Yeah, it's a cop out, everyone. I. Whatever. Is it? If it was John it Connor, I wouldn't be complaining. That's the thing. Yeah, I don't uh, think it is a cop out. I think it, you you set the standard like that they're going back in time in the first movie, so now that exists. So you can use that for other storylines. Well, it also however, makes it easier. However, they didn't establish that there were multiple timelines. <laughs> but the, but you're the you're still virus. establishing you can go back in time, so you're right, still but not multiple timelines. Like, but it's still going to change the, the the outcome in the for the future, right? Yeah, you can still go back in the past. Uh, Kyle, honestly, you might want to check it out, bro. <laughs> See what I'm dealing with over here. Uh, we're, we're just, just so that I can back up what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, you get me, yeah, I mean, no, that's a, that's a fair suggestion. You I might know, like it, but I'm not commenting on on zero exactly. Uh, only what I'm hearing you guys say about that it's there. These are alternate timelines. It, yeah, if I mean, go by where we made it up. into a multiverse, and yeah. The, the, so the biggest lore change is the fact that they made it a multiverse. In the original, whatever it was, let's call it four movies up to up to Salvation. Uh, yeah, okay. So from T two to T three, they postponed uh, Judgment Day, but Judgment Day is inevitable. It's a canon event type thing, which I'm <clears throat> fine with. Right, but it so the underlying idea behind the first at least two movies, right, is that you go back into your own past, not a past, right. Which yeah. you go into your own game save. You don't start a new game plus. Well, th and th there's tons of ways of doing time travel, but you need to stay consistent if that's what you've been doing. 
Yeah. The point but, was, we always knew there were multiple futures, and sometimes people from different alternate futures, they were all coming back to the same past. That's mm -hmm. what, like, the Sarah Connor Chronicles was sort of dealing with. Right. So it all lined up because the different branches were all going back to the same point of basically, like, the creation of the time displacement equipment or whatever. But now that would be canon breaking because now everyone is going back to a new one and just good luck in your new fucking run of the timeline. Right. right. I don't know. It's a little Groundhog Day. That's all. I don't know. Yeah. It is what it is. Let me know. I remember enjoying the Saracana Chronicles. It was good. Some yeah. of the was hot in that. Was totally well. worth a rewatch, by the way. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, Summer of Glass very well. Like, what, 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 whatever happened to Lena Headey before she was Cersei? Oh. Fucking way better as Sarah Connor. Right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Well, well better well. than, uh, yeah, yeah. The yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. Yes. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. Sorry, that's right. Linda I'm Hamilton saying. is still. Yeah, that's. No, I need, sorry, I didn't think I needed <laughs> to do it. Yeah. Goes without saying. Yeah. What, we got to get Sin on here. She needs to explain why she liked Genesis more than Fate. They're both bad. Oh God! Yeah, but yeah, also I out. like Gen if you were to go that route, I would rather watch Genesis than Fate. Fate is just no redeeming qualities. Genesis, no, like I could watch Arnold make a bad robot or rug carpet salesman joke. Curtain hang curtain hangers, right? Curtain hangers, yeah. And she's at least good to look at. Uh, that version of Sarah. Why can't I think of her name? Khaleesi. <laughs> Shit. Um, I'm a toxic. I'm sorry. Yeah, she Amelia Clark. Amelia Clark. Clark. That's yeah. It. Yep. Um, Genesis. Again, a time fucking, they went back, they just went back later and they tried to do the thing. Just give us the future war with the purple lasers. Well, that <sighs> guy, Jai Courtney, is it Jai Courtney? Yes, yeah. Jai, I believe. Such a, such a man, he... He's really good at Spartacus, had, but if you've ever seen see Spartacus, it, he's the best friend, he's really I've, good, he's really good. I, but maybe, after that, maybe, I'm himbo. just commenting on those movies where they tried to push him as this lead, no. you know, hero and it's Die just, hard. He does not have the charisma of a of a lead actor. He does not have that capability in his range. He just yeah. doesn't. Well, yeah, Sin, that... Sin just commented, Dark Fate was a huge waste of everything. They yep. had Linda and Arnold back together and screwed it all up. Yeah. Turned I, Linda into Sin, a drunken right. old bitty. Yeah. We gotta talk about Genesis though, Sin. We gotta we gotta do a intervention. Oh yeah, well we'll get into it next week when uh, <laughs> when hard cuts back on. Yeah, when we have more time because I know Gooch and I are going to have to get out of here probably in like the next ten. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. we do have to talk. Well, fortunately for him, he likes it. He's got a whole big channel. <laughs> unfortunately for me, I got roped into talking about Terminator to defend the other no. people. So yeah, no, 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 no. No, I, okay, no, I like no, hanging no. out too. Fine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't make me say it, Gooch. You son of a bitch. All right, fine. It's fun time. Yeah, I mean it. It's something new. Like I feel like a lot of Netflix, Netflix especially, because they just dump the entire season out in one go. It just becomes like just content. It's not like like in three months, I'm not even going to remember Terminator Zero or like anything that happened in it. Like it doesn't really stay with you. It's fair. No, it's fair. And as Gooch explained, you you can consider it off in its own little Japan universe of uh, Terminator. <laughs> 